See, so with four to five inches of rain falling in a matter of just hours, mud poured down hills like a river, and it was so powerful, homes were pushed off their foundations and buried up to their rooftops. Car-sized boulders littered the streets. The streets were covered in mud. It looked like the entire town had been flooded out. About 7,000 people were under mandatory evacuation orders. About 6,000 homes and businesses were without power, and just see many areas still have no water or sewer service. Highway 101, that's the major freeway that runs through Montecito in Santa Barbara County. It was buried under mud and debris and will remain closed for about 30 miles at least through midday Monday. And while rescue efforts are underway, it's being slowed down because of those closed roads, the downed trees, the downed power lines. And like you mentioned, 17 deaths have been reported. 28 people um, have been injured and there are several that are still reported. It sounded like a freight train coming down the hill. You, you know, you could hear these boulders rolling down. To wake up and not be able to recognize what's going on behind you, this whole area used to be a road, not a huge riverbed. So it's been pretty crazy to wake up to. I had some panic phone calls with some friends in here. Um, they couldn't even talk to me about how flooded their houses were because they were panicked going back in and, and rescuing people. So they couldn't even describe the condition of their house. They were just telling me, I gotta go, I gotta go. I gotta go help more people up there.